Hey guys, happy Vlogmas Day 16. It's Friday. I feel like today's vlog is not gonna be very exciting. I just pulled up to a coffee shop that I haven't been to in a while because um, I actually wanna go tanning around here afterwards because I have some plans this weekend and I have not gone in quite a bit of time. I know it's bad for you, but I've been craving to get this banana iced latte. I love this place. It's Royal Oak Roast. There's one in Birmingham too. I love it here. They have such good food, such good coffee. I feel like I came here a lot more in the summer. I haven't been in a while. Of course, I need to get a bunch of editing and work done this morning. So I thought I would just come here, switch up the environment. And one time when I was here, I heard someone get an iced banana latte. And normally I don't like my coffees or anything flavored, but for some reason that has been stuck on my mind since I've heard it. This was probably, you guys, like six months ago. Like that's how long this banana iced latte has been sticking on my mind and I just have never come and gotten it. So we're gonna work here today for a few hours. I'm gonna get that latte, I hope they have it. I think they have like a bunch of really yummy flavors. They do have amazing food. If you guys live around here, they have such a good like breakfast burrito. And I feel like it's hard to find a cafe, like, just a coffee shop that actually has good real food and they definitely do so i highly recommend that i have my work bag i just like got up today i put my Hailey bieber stuff on the skin stuff and then just my regular moisturizer and i have her lip balm on and i just threw on my big boy jeans i call these my big boy jeans because whenever i don't know what to put on i'm just being lazy that's what i wear a little t-shirt and my fuzzy thing from h&m very casual um i'm gonna work for a few hours then i'm gonna go tan tonight from four to seven i have a it's called a vendor day so this is another one of the little things that i do <laughs> i feel like i do so many little things it's kind of confusing but i work for this small marketing startup and one of the brands is this new cannabis company so they do pop-ups at different dispensaries usually on fridays and they basically like set up a booth to try and get new customers to notice their brand and to purchase their brand from the dispensary and just be familiar with it so they usually need to to like models or like spokes girls at the table and that's not technically my job but whenever I'm free and they ask I will do it so I was free this Friday evening it's from 4 to 7 which I feel like is a good like time um, so I still have time afterwards to either get more work done or I don't know what I'm gonna do later maybe just have like a chill night because tomorrow I have a Christmas party that I'm really excited for so I want to be like charged for that but yeah I have to go home before then get ready put some makeup on i have to wear all black and like the branded t-shirt and i'm basically just like a spokesperson for like three hours that's what we're doing tonight i don't even know how much i can like vlog of that i'm gonna try and show you guys it's nothing like crazy it's pretty self-explanatory but that's kind of all i'm doing today editing computer work the vendor day and then tonight maybe i'll go out for drinks tonight maybe depends how the day goes so gray dark and gloomy here once again and i just want the sun or i want some snow literally yesterday when kelly and i were having our little like christmas thing it was so nice i have to show you guys up close by the way what she got me i'll do a little haul when i get home but i was like okay there's no snow and there's also no sun it's just this like middle ground like ugly gray days for i feel like it's been like this all week and i feel like normally by this time michigan we either have a bunch of snow which i love the snow in the winter time it's part of the vibe or at least have the sun peeking through it's just very like mild luckily it hasn't been crazy cold so i guess that's okay it's been like mild weather but it's just like dark and gray and it's so depressing I hate it so much. That is what's up. I'm going to go inside, um, get my editing on, and I hope there's a table in there. That's like, there's so many little things that go into a coffee shop that make me decide if I'm going to go or not, and I feel like this place usually gets kind of busy to where there's not even a table to sit at. Sure, that may be an issue. Oh my god, they have Christmas cups. This guy getting in his car, they have the cutest coffee Christmas cups. How fun. Now I'm embarrassed. <laughs> okay, let's go inside and get to work.
Hi, sleepyhead. Hi, Missy. Hello, sleepy girl. Here goes. Come on, here, sleepy. Hi, sleepy. These are both sleeping. Both sleepies. Hmm? It's so good. So good, buddy. Okay, guys, I'm back home. I think it's like 3 o'clock. I have to leave here within the next 30, 45 minutes. So thank God my hair is done. I do want to jump in the shower really quickly because I did not shower this morning. And just like after tanning, I use this lotion. I feel like it's a weird smell. So I'm going to take a quick body shower and then sit down and do like a super quick makeup look. I don't even like, it's not that big of a deal, but I definitely need to look presentable. And then I just need to throw an outfit on. So I have to wear this shirt this is the brand granny it's a new detroit weed company so love that last time i wore my like black leather pants but i kind of want to wear these black and white trousers that i have it's a little more businessy and i think the black and white vibe will go really well i was just wearing them so they're on my stock of clothes on this bench that just is never ending i feel like i clean it up and then the next day i have another pile of clothes does anyone else do that where they just like throw clothes that they wore for like a second or like new stuff they gotten in or like stuff you changed out of i just always have this ongoing pile of like they're not dirty yet so i put them on top of something instead of on the floor or instead of in the hamper but i'm too lazy to actually put them away so anyway these are the pants i was thinking they're like businessy trousers i got these from a boutique a few years ago maybe i can try and find the brand because i do love these they're like nice stretchy super comfortable pants but they have like little belt loops and pockets do they have pockets i don't know they don't have pockets but they have like little businessy pant details but it's like a nice stretchy band so i love these and i think it would look really cute with the cropped t-shirts and then i was thinking of maybe wearing my detroit beanie just because we're gonna be in detroit so that would make sense and it's all black and white i'm gonna jump in the shower and then i will see you guys once i start doing my makeup i'm probably gonna do my makeup in the bathroom i don't know the makeup situation is really need to be figured out because i move it for filming and then i sometimes do it in the bathroom because the lighting is better and then sometimes i do it at the vanity i need to find a new spot to make sure it's really going good maybe we'll do that in the new year i feel like that'd be a good new year project is to redo the vanity situation just the makeup setup in general okay guys i didn't even have enough time to film me doing my makeup i went extremely light and quick i'm already running a little bit late so this is the fits the pants i threw on my new black boots from h and m i knew they would come in handy i've worn them so much and then my makeup is just like super natural I am currently microwaving some mini chicken tacos because I have not ate enough today and I'm kind of going to be stuck for the next three hours so I need to eat something. Filling up my water, I packed a green juice. Um, I'm probably just going to throw on my H&M like brown trench that I've been wearing a lot and I'm going to do my lips in the car. I always like do my lips at a red light when I'm running late. So yeah, I am going to literally scarf these tacos down. Sorry this has been so chaotic. Oh shit hot um i'm gonna try and film as much as i can or just like show you a little bit at the actual vendor thing and yeah i don't know what else is going to be in this vlog oh i wanted to show you my gifts from kelly so maybe i'll show you guys those when we get back but i am going to eat these tacos with some franks of course and i put this really good seasoning on it if you guys like a little bit of spice this is the seasoning that i put on it it's so good i got it at target it's a honey sriracha seasoning and yeah look at all my seasonings like i have a problem <laughs> okay i'll see you guys once we get there Hi, babies. Home. We're home. <laughs> wow. Wow. The hallway is so fun. It's so fun out here. The 
kitty catcher's coming. We have to get inside. Come on. Really? I'm back home. We actually were able to pack up a little bit early, so it's 7 o'clock now. Um, and I literally just walked in the door. I want to show you guys the stuff that Kelly got me like up close because I feel like you weren't able to see and I Love my gifts that she got me. They're so cute and it's like something I would never ever Buy for myself. So I feel like that is literally the definition of a perfect gift something you want But you would never buy yourself or like your style and having someone pick it out for you is like the best so I'm feeling <laughs> I was just talking to so many different people like being very on for um, like vendor days so I'm kind of feeling a little brain dead and just like off after having conversations with so many different type of people you definitely have to like be on know how to deal with people who are maybe rude or say weird things and then obviously there's a lot of amazing great people too so we did pretty well it wasn't as crazy busy as some of the other ones I've done because it was a medical dispensary only so in Michigan it's illegal recreationally everywhere um, but a lot of dispensaries are still only medical the ones that have been around longer and then there's of course a ton that are medical and recreational so obviously more people go to those and they just get like crazier and they're bigger so this was more of like a select group of people that are very like getting what they want um, but either way it went well so granny is the brand I put a little sticker on my phone and yeah, I'm happy to be back. I think I'm going to do a little bit of cleaning up around here. Probably going to shower, put something comfy on. And I still have some editing to get done. So I don't think there's going to be anything exciting happening the rest of this vlog. But I do want to give you guys a little haul. I think we should do it in the bedroom. I feel like it's just so much brighter in there when I have both my lamps on and stuff. It's so dark out here. I just set you guys on top of this lamp sometimes to like have a cute background but I feel like it's so dark actually I decided I'm gonna sit on the floor right here and we will do it here it's kind of messy behind me my collection of clothes back there but first look how cute this little old school Santa bag is I love it I threw like a bunch of my other stuff in here too when I was walking home Okay, so first up, oh my god, the bag like literally smells good from this. It's like just coming out of the bag. First, she got me this Jo Malone candle. I love Jo Malone so much. Their scents are amazing. It's just like such a high quality fragrance brand. I've had a few of their perfumes before and they're just so pricey in like such small bottles, but it is such a nice brand. This is like such a good gift. I've never had a candle from them before so this is like gonna be my new bougie candle for like my baths or just like a really special moment. It smells really like spa-like, like super fresh and clean. It's the mimosa and cardamom scent. I love it. It's such a nice scent for a candle. It's very like almost like a powdery but fresh scent. It literally just makes me think of like taking a bath or having like a relaxing night. So I think I'm gonna make this my self-care candle and only light it when I'm having a moment like that. Then she got me two super cute little accessories from Coach. It came in this like wonderful little bag. I feel like that's one of the best things about buying things from like nicer places is that they're already packaged and just look like so much nicer obviously. So of course, Kelly knows me so well and she got me this silk scarf she said it was from their like vintage collection which has my name written all over it vintage neutral silk scarf I think it's so pretty just like the OG classic coach print and it's actually such a big scarf I totally wear this like as a top Kelly said I should do it as like a bathing suit cover-up which would be super cute or obviously how I always kind of do it is like a head wrap so I think that looks really cute. I'm so excited to actually style this and like wear it with a super, I'm thinking of like a super neutral like monochromatic outfit with it. Perfectly to go with it, especially if I wear it on my head. She got me these earrings and I love these earrings so much. I really don't have a lot of like super expensive jewelry. I just buy a lot of like cheap stuff. I have things that are like family related that are more expensive, but not like an everyday like cool really nice jewelry 
so she said she saw these and thought of me instantly they are these little gold chunky hoops and then they have like studs a pearl a little c emblem on there so they kind of like follow that retro like vintagey vibe and of course you can't go wrong with a gold hoop so these with my hair like tied back in the scarf i think is gonna look so freaking cute thank you so much cal i love you i love my gifts so much i think in the clips i haven't edited that vlog yet but i think in the clips you guys were able to see me like setting up her coffee table a little bit i'm not sure if i showed that if i didn't i'll have her like send a picture but i think they looked really good with her space too so we both hit a jackpot on our gifts this year it's so fun doing a little gift exchange with your bestie because it's just like so fun and cute like, we've never really we've never really made it like festive in such a moment like that highly recommend planning something with your bestie if you want to do that because it was just like so nice and special and i think i already told you guys this year for a lot of my family and extended family i'm gonna make homemade cookies and my homemade chimichurri and i'm gonna do a whole video on that probably next week i want to make them like fresh right before christmas for everyone just to save some money and i feel like it's that hard transition where you're growing up and it's like my aunts and uncles that have gone gotten me gifts my whole life I feel like now I have to give them something back because when you're a kid you don't really like get them anything um, and we do like gift exchanges with our cousins and stuff too but I just want to have like a bunch of homemade cookies and my homemade chimichurri to give to my grandparents and aunts and uncles my parents even like my brothers just random people that I'm going to want to give something to and I think making something homemade is like the best easiest gift you can do for the holidays one to save money two I think it's a homemade gift everyone loves something homemade it's like more special it's kind of nice to be able to splurge with Kelly and I because those were the really that was the only like big gift exchange I was going to do this year so anyway and I just wanted to show you guys that because I feel like you didn't see it yesterday. So I am going to clean up around here. I don't know what else is going to happen. I think I'm going to shower. Like I said, shower again, get ready for bed. My makeup is like looking pretty good for being super, super natural. I used that e.l.f. Halo Glow actually on top of my makeup tonight. The number two, the lighter one. And I think I really, really like it. But anyway, that is what's happening. Um, stay tuned, you guys, still for the Q&A video. That's where I'm going to do all the giveaways and that will be a really fun video i think it's going to be coming up really soon i actually wanted to pre-record that earlier today but i didn't have enough time so just stay tuned for the q a video that's where i'm going to do a bunch of giveaways for you guys i wanted to do it like throughout vlogmas but it would have just been too hard to coordinate everything so i thought i would just do one big video and have like a bunch of winners within the one giveaway so keep your eye out for that um and yeah i'm gonna clean up kind of like chill out for a minute and take a break.